And welcome back to Let's Play Spore. Now I noticed the sun levels were a bit high in the last video, so I altered that. I also made so you can see a bit less of my uh, um, task bar down here. Now, uh, Camtasia only records things in windowed mode, so I had to run Spore in windowed mode, which is fine because I have a widescreen monitor and it looks kind of weird in widescreen anyway. So let's uh, let's go ahead and involve, move on. There we go. Travel the path of the omnivore. Yeah, there we go. Achievements, except I unlocked that one approximately five years ago in 2008, but whatever. Now we have the creature creator. Let's see, I have my cilia. Flagella. However, this is what I want. Spit. Poison spit. Um, as a fungus, I'm obviously not going to have legs. So, we don't need them. We're just going to be a little worm. As small as possible. There we go. Tiny little worm. Because after all, we were just a cell. I mean, geez. We're tiny. Alright. That should look pretty interesting when it's running around. I can add cell parts to it now, but I won't do that. I'd like to add more poison spitters, though. I'll be able to do that, though, later. Later. Paint mode, I don't really care about. Paint, how it looks. Looks fine now. Whatever. That's another thing about this game that isn't so great for me. I, um... I don't really much care about aesthetics. It doesn't really matter to me. And so all the creators in this game are just kind of a pointless waste of time to me. Because I care about the gameplay. But unfortunately, the gameplay is... quite lacking. God, this thing looks so stupid. I hope the sound level's alright. I didn't change him much because I'm trying to keep with some kind of evolutionary trend and not completely alter everything about my species in one generation. Oh wow. Look at the way they move. Blah 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 blah, made landfall, yes! And we all know that creatures that don't have eyes just merely see things in black and white. And I'm going to be doing this whole playthrough with no eyes. Also, I'll need to use my other hand now for WASD controls. So, here's a piece of fruit that we can eat. Because remember, we're omnivores. Oh wait, no we can't. That's right, because I have a, a carnivore mouth right now. I am an omnivore though. Yeah. So I can digest meat, I just need to have the proper apparatus to eat it. Alright. So... Let's do a little attacking. Yeah! Epic combat. Oh boy, that was amazing. Eat him! Eat him! There we go. And let's continue doing this. Also, this game is rather tedious. Let's see... Spit. That does not seem to have actually done anything. Use charge on me, cheater. Spit is highly ineffective. Oh, well, yeah, I forgot I can use the numpad here. Yes, I don't know. I think for let's playing purposes, I may give my creatures eyes simply because this game looks really hideous in black and white. 
And let's go ahead and kill off these guys. Finish our first little quest. I think this game is meant to be played with eyes. So, alright. There we go. If you just saw a creature spinning over there, that, that would be the last one of these creatures spinning out of existence. Maybe I have a sprint. No, that's sneak. Never mind. Ooh, as a fungus, I think I'd be very good at sneaking. Oh, look, here's a mate. And skip. Okay, and this is the real creature creator. Now, I need to give myself some omnivore mouth. Oh, yes. That's a very fungaloid looking mouth. There we go. And of course, I could modify it and make it all dumb looking, but I don't need to do that. Do that, and let's um, increase the length of my spine by one. I'm still gonna be a little slug creature, though. Also, let's get rid of the cilia and flagella. And put this thing over here, maybe orient it like that. There we go. Yeah, and I guess I can just put some eyes somewhere. Let's do eyes that are not animated like these. Well, they're animated, but not so much. Ooh. These look kind of fungaloid. I guess. I don't know. Maybe if I did empty eyes, made them really small, and hid them underneath my spitting thing. There we go. Alright, and the horns I don't really think I'll need either, but I'll go ahead and keep them. Nah, I wanted to want them. And now, let's see, graspers, we won't ever have any of those. As a fungus, we have no need of legs or feet. Ah, yes, there we go. We have the cellular spitting thing, which sucks. Let's get this thing, which looks very similar, but it's not. I swear. Okay. And then let's get two of these things as well. All right. And then I'll want to get some sneak. Yes, there we are. A little bit of green on this fungaloid body. Hmm. Try to make that level with the ground, I guess. There we go. Yeah. Oh, I can give him wings. No, I don't think wings are very necessary. And a little armored plate, sure. All right. Isn't he adorable? Adorable. Almost unanimated. All right. Wasn't that some nice, gradual evolution? Yes, it's fantastic. My god, these things look so stupid. Alright. Start as a baby. A parent teaches you how to do things. Or you hit escape and skip all this. There we go, okay. Now, can I recruit party members yet? I don't think so. Nah. Alright, but now... 
I can eat fruit and not vomit. So there's that. I can't jump, though. That's okay, though. That's okay. Let's see. What are these things? There we are. Some nice little low-level creatures. My special ability is Summon Flock, which uh, calls other creatures to me. Oh man, that didn't work. Man, that spit ability is really not doing me any good. Normally spit is completely overpowered and annihilates things, but I guess not this bit. Let's see, are there any babies I can kill? Come on. First, let's rip up this skeleton. Yes. Body parts litter the ground. Why am I doing no damage with my spit? I don't understand. There we go. That did some damage. There we go. You see, this is why I'm not doing a Let's Play This Game all the way through the space phase, because um, it would be really freaking boring in the space phase, because it's rather tedious. Extremely tedious, actually. Alright, good. As a fungus, I'm not very sneaky. Thing will kill me. Stay away. Let's see. What are these things? All right. Forgot. Sneak. So sneaky. So sneaky. And critical strike. Right? No, of course not. No damage. So we'll just spam bite. Like always. There we go. As you can see, this game is already kind of boring. It's very repetitive, this game. I mean, I like it. I'm having fun. But it's probably not very interesting to watch. Uh, I just wanted to make this Let's Play so I could complain a bit, really. Oh well. We've got a whole game to play through. No, actually, we don't have a whole game to play through because it's Spore. There is no game. Well, there is a game. It's just very shallow and boring. Finish going up these things. A lot more parts. Go evolve. You yeah, know, the usual. How many on time? 13 minutes. We are fine. Whoop, keep attacking. Sorry. And I evolved a bit. Okay. Some more little level one creatures. Ah, they don't like me. But I like you. I like you so much. Oh look, there's a stick. If I actually had arms and hands, I could manipulate this stick and, and use it as a weapon. But I'm not doing that. So right now they're not ganging up on me, but normally these creatures would be all over me, annihilating me. Get back here. There we go. Oh, I see. It does damage over time. Oh. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay, all right. And let's kill this thing. Voila. I got graspers. Fantastic, really. Another skeleton. These things just litter the ground. They're freaking everywhere. Oh, hey, a Maxis created creature. Very nice. 
Oh, uh, these things are kind of powerful. Actually, I don't think I'll mess with them. Ah, I think that's the next level of our uh, mouth. Well, first, let's kill these things. Ah, here's another Maxis created creature. Yeah, you see, all these creatures are different, but fighting them is all the same. They're all the same. The only thing that makes this phase a little bit more interesting about the, is the uh, the Titan creature thing. But even then, the Titan creatures are fairly few and far between. And also, you can't really do anything with them. I mean, you can try to kill them, but you'll probably fail. Uh, yeah. For some reason, playing this makes me want to play The Sims. And no, don't worry, I'll never do a Let's Play of that. Yes, The Sims and I have an odd relationship. Um, I only play about once every six months. But, uh, it comes a time, about, oh, twice a year or so, that I'll just say, Man, I really want to play The Sims! And I'll sit down, boot it up, and play it for 13 hours and then get up and not play it again for those six months cause that's just how I roll dog. that's just how I roll ah they have the proviscus I, I was being very very sarcastic when I was speaking in that very dumb way the proviscus is so awesome I wish I had a proviscus give me your proviscus Give it to me. I want it. No, it's a cell part. It would suck. But still. Come on. Spit in your face. Spit in your face. Spit. There we go. I will not be following a middling path in this. I think, I think I'm just going to kill everything. Because I'm a fungus, right? That's what I do. That's, that's totally how fungi work, right? They kill things? Yeah, they're hunters. Definitely. Definitely. Predatory fungi. Mmm. You notice these things are more powerful, so I have to hunt more of them over here. Oh boy. very likely will not get the parts you want. Oh well. And in the game, always at the same point, some uh, UFO will come and try to abduct you. Or no, not try to abduct you, just abduct something near you. And it's just, it's, it's always the same. I wish this game could be great. Oh, here. There we go. But it's not. It's not great. There we go. Alright. One last, uh... What is called? Rutophilia to hunt. And then we will be, uh, fully... Fully uh, complete with this quest. You don't have poison spit. Interestingly, this thing has the electric thing, but um, the electric, th this thing here, that in the cell stays makes you emit electricity, actually does nothing here. Oh, that's not pretty. These horn looking things. Okay. Actually, does nothing for you here in the uh, creature phase. Let's see, how many on time? 19 minutes. Just fine? Just fine. Yes, we're a very strange fungus. Maybe we're not a fungus. Definitely a protist. Definitely a protist.
Move that, replace it with a little leaf. What? Bulbasaur is evolving! I'm gonna make the leaves smaller. Ooh. I can get both of these for a double health bonus. I think. No? No. I can't. Alright, well, whatever. We'll just keep using that then. And let's see here. Not useful, not useful, not useful, not useful, not useful. No, 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 no. There we go, we did unlock the next level of this mouth. It's a scary mouth. Alrighty. And we're done. Continuing on. Where are my eyes? Well, anyway. Now I'll show you the, uh... Party making ability. Yes, there you go. Now I have a hunting party. Now you notice in my mini-map, there's a little white trail. That is because, um... My little group of creatures has migrated. Migrated far, far away. And you probably don't want to see me go there, so I'm just going to go ahead and cut that out, and I'll see you when we get there. I, uh... I died. Alright, so as I was walking along, I killed off this nest of creatures, and, um... The meteor shower happened. Yes, this meteor shower always happens at exactly this moment. Ah, uh, invariably. Oh god! Now I'm being attacked. Yeah. Whoa, run, 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 run. Okay. Because I conquered this nest, I heal at it, which is very nice. And I'll just keep collecting parts. What are these things over here? Ooh, weak. That's what they are. Let's go kill them. Kill the weak. Yes, my spit now interrupts charges. Very nice, very nice. I wish I could play as a plant. Wish I could play as a protist. Wish I could play as a slime mold. Wish I could play as anything. It's about the evolution of life. Should be able to do whatever I want. But no. But no. Good. Good, good. I have a little meat snack. And continue with our little attack. I don't know if there are uh, three more Totooks left, though. That's annoying. Sometimes it'll tell you to kill things that don't exist, or tell you to kill too many things. Kill six Totooks. Well, there are only five in existence, so the quest is impossible to complete. So that's annoying. Oh, now this is, uh... This is impossible to do. I'm gonna die again. Fantastic. Nothing I can do about it, though. Ah, back to the spawning pool. Leveled up again. I still haven't migrated, either. I just keep, um... Getting distracted and trying to kill things and not going to my next nest. Oh, well. All that DNA is going to your head. Ha 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 ha. That was almost funny. Oh well, to be honest, back in 2008 that was funny. Unfortunately, it's 2013 now, and uh... uh this game is still a disappointment. Ooh. Just scoot away from those things. Oh wait, no, no, wait, I... I'm high enough level that I can deal with these things, yeah. Hmm. Except they'll kill me in groups if I try to attack them. I have to pick them off 
one by one on the side. Like this one, you separated. He should attack me without any help from his buddies. Well, alright, just one buddy, I guess, is better than two or three or four or five. Use my special ability, summon the flock! Which means that a bunch of uh, friendly creatures are gonna come out of nowhere and start helping me. There we go. Now these things are dead. Dead, dead, dead. Oh yeah. Summon Flock is really powerful. And now you're dead. And with this one dead, all the rest of them will uh, just evaporate into thin air. I am recording, yes? Yes, I am recording. Alright. And, uh... That's that. Wow, I'm almost done with the creature phase, and I still haven't migrated. Ah, good, here's a nest over here. To which I can migrate. I also really need to level up, too, so I'll do that. Once I finally get to the nest. And we're here! Holy crap, that's a big egg. Wow. <laughs> Go. Bigger nest. And this is where our tribe and city will be located. A nice in location where it cannot be attacked by ships. Anyway, let's mate. If you can uh, find a nate from around this giant friggin' egg. Hmm. Okie dokie. So now we have a lot of uh, evolving to do. Problem solvent. Oh, that's that's very funny. All right, and get some of these. Throw them on there. There we go. Okay, and now let's get an eye. Maybe. Yeah, let's get some eyes and just throw them on the back there. Hide them underneath these spitters. There we go, yeah. Fantastic. Alright, I guess I'll get a little. A little bit of my food stuck on me. Branches, you know. Being a fungus and all, it makes sense, I guess. Hmm. Think I need to orient this a bit better. Like that, there we go. Oh, wow, talk about front loading. And let's also get some better bone. There we go. Fantastic. Get lots of health. Oop, good. And the next level of mouth is unlockable. There we go. And make it a bit smaller. Ooh. That's not what I wanted. Alright. And now we hatch. Fantastic. <laughs> God, these things are so stupid looking. <laughs> Whatever. Let's get some more party members. Get a party going. A party. Alrighty. 
I'll go collect this part, and then I believe we will be done with this part of the Let's Play. So, thank you for joining me on Let's Play Spore. Next time, we will finish the creature stage. Maybe 30 minutes? Actually, no. I think I'll do the entire creature stage all in one video. If it takes an hour, then so be it. That's fine. Whatever. If I have to split this video, then I'll split it right there. What the heck is that thing doing over here? Oh, whatever. Let's kill it. There we go. Effective. Effective. <laughs> Get back here. Oh, way to ruin our fun. My party members seem very occupied with uh, that baby. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Have a little snack, have a little snack, regenerate. Okay, run. No. It's like Mountain Blade. If I die, my entire party dies instantly. It doesn't make any sense. Oh, dang it. There's not really much of a penalty for dying. It's just kind of annoying. Oh, well, let's get a third party member. Party. Excellent. And continue on. They don't appear to have any way of moving, they just kind of move. You know, whatever. <laughs> spit, 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 spit. And we'll just keep annihilating this fellow, there we go. And kill this one, and then that should extinct, uh, make the species extinct. There we go, that's better. Also, if you kill eggs, you get a lot of, uh, DNA points. Not that I really need DNA points, but yeah, just click on an egg. And you'll start chomping away at it. There we go, I got 25 DNA points. Oh, the UFO is here. Hello, UFO. Yes, the UFO always comes at the same time. Always. Get over here! Oh, that's so great. And he just got abducted. Fine. I'll take this one. Get over here! The UFO is distracting them, so they're not attacking back, which is nice. Flying won't save you! Where'd he go? There he is. Excellent. Oh hey, another bunch of creatures. Good. I'll make them go extinct too, then I should uh, level up again and go beyond uh, this phase. Yeah, now we're not unstoppable with our party. Well, that's just a baby. It's not worth my time. That thing is though, it's an alpha. Kill it. If I made a giraffe-like creature with a nice long neck, I could eat this high hanging fruit. Not that I'd ever really want to do that. That's kind of, you know, Bit too labor intensive for me. Yes, and as you can see, the creatures have disappeared. There's one, but it's just a baby. And when you kill a baby, it doesn't actually count. Oh, nope, never mind, it does count. Good. Fantastic.
Moving on. Let's kill these Yvurg. Things I created way back in 2008. I remember creating these things. Oh, man. Hmm. We're not really winning this one so easily. That's fine, though. That's fine. Whatever. My party members can die. That's totally fine. They can be replaced. But me? No. It's not okay if I die. Yes, bit is so great. Damage over time. Hey. Don't strike me with those claws of yours. There we go. Yep. Ding, level up. Ready right into the travel phase. Fantastic. And ding. There we go. Sapience. Yay. Now we just need to go home. All the way home. I'll see you there. Interestingly, it seems as though my tribe, my group of creatures has migrated again to a different location. But you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and not migrate with them and end the phase. Really? That was under an hour? Hmm. Alrighty. Definitely a, uh, definitely a, a predator, that's for sure. And now we finish the creature stage. Evolve the creature for the last time. Let's get this thing. Ooh, I don't like that. There we go. That's a weird looking thing. Right, get rid of these stupid branch things. They're dumb. I think get rid of these leaf things too. And let's instead replace them with some armor. Wanna be very well armored fungus. There we go. These things are still cartoonishly large. But they do cover up my eyes, so I guess I'll leave them there. Whatever, that's fine. Alright, and I guess we're done. So ends the creature phase. Next comes the travel phase, then civilization, then the end of the Let's Play. Oh yes, the music I was humming at the beginning of the Let's Play. This, uh, this cutscene makes a lot more sense if your creature has hands. Floating, obviously. Fungi, uh, they do that. And then a very, very unglorious congratulations you are about to enter the tribal phase appears after that epic cutscene. Alright, and I suppose I'll cut out the loading screen and I'll see you guys next time.